Hey guys, and welcome back to our channel. I wanted to do a school supply haul today. I wasn't planning on waiting this long, but I've been waiting on a backpack and headphones and they're still not here yet. And I looked online and it said they probably won't be here until August 16th, I think. So I was like, okay, I'm not waiting until August 16th to do a school supply haul. So we're doing it now, minus a backpack and headphones. But that's all right. You'll kind of get the gist of it. All right. Okay. So I went to target.com and literally ordered everything off of there. Got it shipped right to the house because I'm not good with big stores. I'm not good with a lot of people and I'm not good with spending a lot of time in big stores with a lot of people. So we did it all online. Okay. And don't mind my house behind me because everybody is like, freak you. It's just been a rough day today. So let's do this really quick and hopefully everybody cooperates with me. All right, so I got our school supply list here. This was both of the girls' I've got two going to school this year, one in kindergarten and one in second grade. So let's get to this. All right, so this is the second grader school supply list and she had to have two spiral bound um, one subject notebooks and these were 59 cents a piece at Target and got them shipped right to the door and she had to have a plastic folder with prongs and that was 99 cents so there's that and she also had to have a ziploc bag gallon size bags my mom ended up getting these at sam's club and bringing to me so i don't know an exact price on those but we have those and next was markers she had to have one pack of washable markers these were a dollar or two dollars and 79 cents at target.com so 10 of them crayola brand it was a pretty good deal i thought and she had to have colored pencils. These were 99 cents for 12 of them. And she had to have ultra fine tip dry erase markers. And these were $2.69, which they're the Expo brand. Pretty good. And she had to have toothpaste. She is in a uh, low functioning autism class. So they do like a lot of life skills. So we got, I just ordered some AIM toothpaste for her. It was only 89 cents. So pick that up. She had to have some crayons, which were 50 cents for 24 of them. She had to have a toothbrush as well. This was 99 cents. And I got uh, sharpened pencils, 18 of them. And these were $3.39, but they're already sharpened, pretty good deal. And she had to have two bottles of Elmer's School Glue. And this was, let me see here, $1.44. And it's the 7.6 fluid ounces. And then she had to have two packs of Clorox disinfectant wipes, which I got a good deal because I got three packs for $5.49 and she had to have two and the other one had to have one. So it worked really, really well. And she had to have two packs of Kleenexes and the, and the other girl had to have two packs of Kleenexes. So I got four for $5.99, which isn't bad. So other than a backpack, that's what I'm waiting for my second grader. We're waiting on a backpack. Oh wait, no. And she had glue sticks. We had, a, I got a pack of glue sticks. These were 50 cents. So this is all her school supply stuff. And then on to the kindergartner. Oh my God. She had to have six glue sticks and these were, six, one, or no, she had to have four. She had to have four Elmer glue sticks and these were $2.29, but it came with six. So I was like, okay, I'll just hand them to, I'll just give her six. And she also had to have the dry erase markers. And like I said, these were $2.69. I also got her a pack of the sharpened pencils, 18 of them. These were $3.39. And she had to have two packs of crayons, which like I said a minute ago, these were 50 cents a piece. And then she needed two folders no, with no prongs. And these were 15 cents a piece. So can't beat that. I got the yellow and green one. And she also had to have a one subject notebook. And this was 59 cents. I love the design of this. I thought that was like super cute. See, see it? Aww. She also had to have the gallon size bags. Like I said, my mom got those at Sam's Club. And we got her a Shopkins backpack. This was super cool. It was $17.99. Yeah, it's yours. And it came with a lunchbox. The lunchbox came with an ice pack, water bottle. It came with a pencil case and it had like a little uh, chapstick and then like a little, I don't know, like a little decorative ball, but it was $17.99. I thought those were really cute. And she had to have two packs of Play-Doh. These were 50 cents a piece. And like I said about the Kleenexes, she had to have Kleenexes and where's her Clorox wipes? And she needed a Clorox wipes, but I bulked that all together. And like I said, this was four boxes for $5.99. And then I got three of these Clorox things for $5.49. 
and I'm waiting for headphones for her. She had to have headphones for school, but we got her a really nice pair for like $17 because she complained about her last pair of headphones, how they hurt her ears. So we got like a nice pair. And then we got her Fisker scissors, $1.49 for these. And then both girls needed a change of clothes to take to school with them. So that is this. Now, that's all the school supplies that we did at Target. And then we Okay, and I got a couple of shirts for the girls. These are $5 a piece, but this I'm one's like sorry, the... Guys. It's okay. I'm, guys, I'm sorry. I'm, I just wanted to do a light, so I don't have this off of me. Okay. And the clothes are really, really cute. They, I have playlists for my first day of school. Yes. So they were $5 a piece, and then this one says, like, math, reading, science, history, gym, and friends. And then we got this one with the heart on it. And then I got Quinn a couple dresses, which Taylor could wear these too, honestly. But uh, they're just, I don't know. They're the kind of dresses that she likes. She wants to wear this one. She loves the planets. So she wants to wear this one for her first day of school. It's a really cute little, like, A-line dress. Really adorable. I with it. Yep. And then we got this little A-line dress. So those are all the shirts we got. And then we got leggings. These were all $5 a piece. Or, yeah, was that $5 a piece? Yeah, they were all $5 a piece. And the dresses were $8 a piece. And then this A-line one right here was $14. So, not bad. And then we got some shoes. The shoes were... The pink shoes, these were $9. And then I thought they were so cute. And I love these shoes. These were $9 as well. And then we got the girls, like, two pairs of white tennis shoes to wear with their dresses. Those were $14 a piece. Oh, I forgot to mention this. Quinn needed a beach towel, too. And I thought this was so cute. It's got, like, an ice cream cone on it. But, yeah, it's an ice cream cone that says yum, which I thought it was, like, adorable with that little smiley face on it. And Quinn loved it. And then we got Taylor some sandals. And these sandals, these were, like, a little more expensive. But I loved them, how they looked. And she needs something, like, she doesn't like things between her toes. And, obviously, they had to have a back one. But these were $19. But I love these. And these are Taylor's gray pair of tennis shoes for school. They were $9. And then I already opened these, but this is just an example. But we got socks for the girls. And the socks were... The socks were $8.49 for 12, but they're real, real soft. I wish you guys could feel these. And they're Hanes, so like they're a real good brand. And they, I feel like they're gonna be a little more durable than the girl socks last year, but we got 12 pairs of these. They're like green, white, blue, purple. And then we got some new undies. <laughs> Quinn said, ew, that I was showing these, but I already opened them so she could see them. But they got Vampirina on them. And the undies were, the undies were, I got eight pairs for $9.79, but they're super cute for Quinn to wear to school. But that is it. That was our school supply haul. And I think my grand total, because I, sh I bought them over the weekend and it was tax free, so I didn't pay taxes on them. And so my grand total was like $279, like $80 for everything, which I think is a really great deal, especially with like all the clothes that we ended up getting for the girls. And um, not pictured, obviously, is the headphones, the book bag, and then two other pairs of shoes a pair of sandals for Quinn and a pair of tennis shoes for Quinn. So, honestly, I got eight pairs of shoes, three dresses, three shirts, five pairs of leggings, the underwear, the socks, all the school supplies, and it was $2.79. You cannot beat that, especially that I did not even have to leave my house. Like, that was beautiful. And one of their school supply lists, Kent Quinn's, I literally just went on there and clicked the, the school that she goes to and what grade she's in, and it put everything in my cart. It was genius. Target has it going on. Um, tr trust me. But yeah, so this is our school supply haul for the 2018-2019 school year. I'm really, really, really excited. I love the girls' teachers this year. I think it's going to be a great year. And I'm going to be home with the baby of the family. We have a three-year-old that gets to stay home with me every day. And I'm kind of excited because when he was born, it's you. But when he was born, I had a three-year-old, a 17-month-old, and him. So he's never really gotten like any like alone time or really a lot of attention because we just had our hands full when he was born. So I think this is gonna be really good for him. We'll just get some mommy and me time. But I'm really excited. What's your school supply list look like? Do you guys have like a ton of stuff like the girls do? I mean like their lists are literally packed, but I'm excited. It's gonna be a good school year. What's your school supply list look, look like? Where did you shop at? Was it crazy? Did you do it online? Did you spend a ton of money? Where'd you get good deals? Oh, I want to know. Play Pokemon Go. Yeah, we'll play Pokemon Go this summer. Yeah. But if you
you like these kind of videos, give us a thumbs up. Subscribe. I love doing shopping videos. Yes, and I love doing hauls and all that. So subscribe if you like these kind of videos, and we'll see you later.